My name is Elizabeth Stevens, and I am a congenital cardiac surgeon at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. My area of interest and expertise is congenital cardiac surgery, including neonatal repairs, single ventricle palliation, as well as conditions such as tetralogy of Fallot, various valve diseases, and hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. I perform repairs on babies, children, and adults with congenital heart disease. Congenital cardiac surgery is an exciting and extremely rewarding field. Now 95% of congenital heart disease patients live to adulthood. That is incredible given that the use of the heart-lung machine didn't start until the 1950s, and Mayo was a pioneer in that regard. It is a true privilege to be a congenital cardiac surgeon and work at the Mayo Clinic. This isn't a job that I have to do. I get to help children and adults, many of whom, even a generation ago, didn't have hope for their condition. Mayo is an incredible place to practice medicine. There is such a devotion to the care of the patient and attention to detail not seen elsewhere, and each person on the team is striving to better themselves and our ability to provide care. It truly is a team approach, which is critical, particularly in the congenital fields. My path to becoming a cardiac surgeon is a bit unique. I was doing physics-related research as an undergraduate, which I loved and was very successful at, but found it too far removed from practically helping people. So I started volunteering in a cardiac ICU and eventually entered an MD-PhD program. Then one fall morning in my first year of medical school, the chief of congenital cardiac surgery at Texas Children's gave a talk in our embryology class. I had never met a surgeon before or seen surgery. Needless to say, I was hooked. I proceeded to do my PhD research on tissue engineering heart valves for pediatric application, did a postdoc fellowship and completed adult cardiac followed by congenital cardiac surgery training. I continue to pursue research as we at Mayo strive not only to provide the best care now, but aim to be the front runner in the world developing the care of the future.